Matthew Wayne and Joe Leach. In comes uh, Steve Finn Bowles and clipped away uh, towards the leg side there did Steve Lovely Finn. That was, it was a beautiful shot. Everything can continue as Curry is now bowling to Lees who comes down the track and plops him over mid on and that will run away for four. That is Lees' first. Tom Alsop who's more of a second slip than a first. In fair, comes ground, fair bit of ground to cover. Finn in bowls as a poor delivery. Alex Lees in his eye line. He's in now and Lees is carving him brilliantly through backward point for four. Well, the good news is no rain so far. There's lots of cloud around, just the odd splash of blue sky. And Durham, who are batting first, off to a really good start. But it is going to be slower today with all the rain we've had. Curry's in. This is again down the leg side. And Lees is able to flick this past short fine leg and that will run away. Out, but clouds are looming in Bex Hill, says John. It's Curry's into Clark, who's carving shot. this one through point for four. Beautiful shot, wasn't it? Rest. Well, in comes Henry Crokham from the Cromwell Road and the ground Whoa. bowls to Alex Lees, who absolutely well, he belts that through mid off a four. On duty as Arsene Prentice is in, slightly fuller and Clark. Shot. Wow, that is a shot of the highest. It's a player who's got a lot of confidence in his game as Hudson Prentice is in again. And oh my god, Graham Clark, you are on a good. That's a, that's a brilliant story, that. So Hudson Prentice is in again, short, and Graham Clark has lofted that one. I think he's got all he has indeed. Rob. It is indeed as Hudson Prentice is in again. And Clark is flicking him through the leg side. He will probably want. Oh, it's a misfield. Carson. Bowls. And Lee hammers that away onto the leg side. And that is going to be four runs. I runs away from us. In and bowls to Alex Lees. And Lees clips this one down to find leg and picks up a comfortable single. Does Alex Lees. And that's a half century for the Durham opener and he gets a very well deserved round of applause 50 or 43 balls in 63 minutes um, as Carson is in and Clark is using his feet driving down the ground Crokham again up the hill bowls and Clark hammers that one away well just as I say that he bowls up <laughs> a deep backward square as in comes Crokham bowls short pulled away now that could no. be out he's going to be caught Graham Go Clark on. and he is caught but it was short from Henry Crow. This probably is going to get clipped for four by David Beddingham. Very bare, and Beddingham instead drives Shot. Hudson Prentice straight back past it. As Coles is now in to bowl his first ball to Lees, who immediately brings out the reverse sweep. I think he's got a fine tick on. As in comes Carson again, bowls, and Lees pulls his way on the leg side, and that's gone all the way for four. It's, right it's time that one. So just break off. In comes Carson again, round the wicket bowls. Lee takes a couple of steps down the wicket and hammers that away. Straight down the ground, one bounce, four run. Look. In comes Carson, round the wicket bowls, and Lee's pulls that way. It's going to be four more. Well, they're not going to let them settle at all. Carson in bowls, and he's hammered as if to make the ball. Oh, oh my Benito, God. Devito just belts that one without any further punishment. And it's a slog sweep which Lees has dissected the gap for four, end of the over, he moves himself into the 80. Very good over this from Coles so far. Wide, back of a length and my mm, commentator's curse is out again. That we cannot buy the headsets. Thanks again, says Graham. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you all about that in a moment, Graham. In comes Haynes and Bowl. Oh, that's <laughs> huge! Huge, huge, huge by David <laughs> Bentley. He's given me a detailed description, so I'll be able to inform. In comes Haynes, bowls, <laughs> but he's absolutely belted that away, and it's got, well, I say belt. At the end of the over, I think, in comes Haynes, bowls to Bedding, who's at it again, and he oh smashes my. that down that's, the ground. That's, that's four more. Very poor bowling by their standards as Coles is now around the wicket to Beddingham. He's going long, harp. Beddingham, 59 off just 38 deliveries. He goes again. I'm not sure he gets it for six. Curry, around the wicket in bowls. Beddingham hammers that away, and that's going to be four more. In comes um, Curry bowls, and Lees plays the ball down the ground. And there we are. That's a century for Alex Lees. And in all the Steve won't see many better in one day cricket. He's only 21 away from surpassing that as David Benningham oh. that, that will be six.
start really going for it as Bedingham moves himself in to the 80s. He goes again. That one is even more impressive. Wowee. And again, no less than sparky time. It's Bedingham on strike. Oh, oh my God, he's done it again. This is what he was asking for. In comes Finn Hudson Prentice in the sunshine. Bowls to Alex Lees. He drills the ball to bit two off. Ball. And it's run away for four runs. So that's the 150 partnership between these two. Hudson Prentice in again. Lees pulls the ball away. That's four more. Two short from Hudson Prentice. Textbook. Here comes Hudson Prentice around the wicket bowls. And Lees helps this one away. That's going to be four more. He's now over the wicket to Alex Lees and he's uh, <laughs> he, he's been met with disdain that's so I can't access there but we are in we are trying to track it down and that will take David Beddingham to a remarkable century of just 52 deliveries okay we'll see if we can get confirmation of that in comes Carlson again around the wicket bowls to Lees he's looking to swing away the other side and there goes Alex Lees is gone he looks disappointed but umpire Blackwell's finger is up and Sussex pick up a wicket for 25 is coming into bowl to um, the right handed Debbie Bedding is in and Beddingham just smashes the first gone. ball down the ground and he's caught he's caught at long off by Tom Olsen might be something might be nothing but again if they can work if these two can work the quick singles it's heavy work for the Sussex fielders as Pretorius goes again oh my god that's even no it's, no, it's not. not I thought it was and it's gone it's caught it's highest score is 405 for 4 as McKinney goes for a switch here. he's hit on the pad and that is given out LBW Liam Travaskis is the new batter and he is out first ball with a court and bold to Jack Carter third oh. man third man excuse me as Coglin is clean bowled by Hudson Prentice and this is a tale of uh, innings of two hard Brad Carriato is naught for 76 so they've all gone around the park in comes Croke and Bowles hammered away that's going to be caught should as be, Harrison Ward be. is underneath it and that's a straightforward catch Curry with the second ball of the final over he's in and Drissell is out of what has been a fantastic first innings for Durham it's Brad Curry and Bushnell comes down the track flicks him leg side two fielders converge they should come back for two and oh. they will do but there will be no overthrow so at the end of 50 overs for Durham three men saving one on the offside three on the leg as in comes Cochrane Bowles oh something's bold he's York Tom Allsop plays all around Paul Cogling stroke first ball as Pretorius is in and Haynes is driving that imperiously back down the ground for four but Sussex are already chased staring down the barrel here as Pretorius is in Haynes with a Shot. beautiful back foot punch running down the hill from the Cromwell Road and he's in and bowls and Pujara eases that is he going to get caught no he's not in fact it's a good in the break as it's a slower ball from Pretorius and Pajara has done amazingly well to there's a group of three fielders on the offside that get in the side so Clark is the man entrusted Cochrane bowls to Haynes and Haynes pulls that away that's going to go away for six run George Giselle are the spin options as Haynes cuts this one into the ground and he's done brilliantly well that is another up at Durham Cochrane bowls Haynes drives that's four runs. lovely shot by Tom Haynes that's one of his favourite shots he's getting his chance in his competition and also he's being rewarded with those England youth team chances as Drizzo is in back of a leg and there's a corn bold wow in comes Gibson around the wicket bowls pulled Ooh. away by uh, Tom with Sussex 99 for two Travaskis left arm around the wicket bowl short pulled away because oh what a catch oh what a catch that is that is absolutely brilliant um, and that's that's what that's what really racked up as far as Sussex were concerned uh, pushing in again bowl and he's gone behind he goes into his fourth over here down the right is that slumping it's out Bushnell runs away from us right time over the wicket he's in and bowls and Carter drives to mid on and he's caught by Alex Lees <laughs> another wicket goes down his run up and he's bowled him I think a slight inside edge there from Jack Carson 100 in particular in comes Gibson bowls and Hudson Prentice is going to be caught at backward point and that could be the end of the fun and games he's gone to 18 and we're going to see Liam Travaskis back into the attack and immediately down the wicket stumped and that's it